Well, I wanted to be a hockey player, and uh, it was a, a sport. Uh, I played all sports. Um, I played baseball. I was very good at baseball, and uh, I was uh, asked uh, a senior year in high school to pick a, a sport I wanted to play professionally, and I thought, well, why are they asking me that so soon? I mean, I was still enjoying the games, and I loved the games, but um, I made a decision, and I, I said hockey is my favorite sport, so hockey's always been my favorite sport. I think the, 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 the one that really, really struck me is, um, you know, prior to the Soviet Union challenge of, um, which was probably the biggest um, test of, of our ability as a team, and as an individual. But the saying, the saying that he said you were born to be a player, you were meant to be a player, and this moment is yours. Now go take it from him. That stuck with me for many years, and I know there's numerous Brooksism, but when, when I heard him say, you're born to be a player, that was my life. And I did everything I could. It's more in the heart that won. That brings back, boy, I'll, I'll tell you, there's a lot of pranksters on. Uh, we were so close knit from different parts of the country, so we all had our little, we had our Eastern guys that were suave and they would be dressing like, like they were in Hollywood. <laughs> what does he think he's going to Hollywood? You know, and then of uh, course, the, the, the pranksters, we, we had Harrington who, who basically was, was well reserved, real quiet, and uh, he was keeping all the Brooksisms and he would pull little pranks here and there and start mimicking Brooks and you know it just it brought us together uh, you know as a team some of the the pranks that uh, you know most teams do have some pranksters every team does but uh, we had 20 guys that were just uh, I, I would have to say had similar similar backgrounds similar upbringings and uh, Basically, I think psychologically, when Brooks took the test, he, he selected 20 players that were very similar. And uh, Pranksters was part of, part of the, the makeup of 20, 20 players that he put together. And, and you, you, you sit and wonder, I mean, we weren't the greatest players, but, but we were, had similarities as far as doing pranks on each other. I mean, uh, Mark Pavlis would be playing his guitar in his room and he'd shut his door and I was his roommate. And, I said, Pav, come on out. You know, quit, quit playing that damn guitar. I said, I want to go to sleep. And he would just keep playing the guitar. And that was his way. And he played the guitar on the bus. And he played that guitar. So his little pranks were, leave me alone. You know, I'm under enough stress with this coach. And let me play the guitar. But to me, I mean, I've never seen anything like that. I've never seen a guy carry a guitar with him everywhere and play in his room. And, and uh, he, was, he, was, he was really in tune to Neil, <laughs> Neil Young. <laughs> so, you know, Neil Young was a great musician, however, <laughs> some of his songs <laughs> were somewhat boring. <laughs> so John Harrington and I had to sit there and listen to Pavels, sit there and play this guitar all day, coming home from practice, we're exhausted and tired, <laughs> trying to get something to eat. Here's this guitar playing all night. I mean, he, he had his own way, and, and that was his prank. But uh, I think the, the one that held the most pranks would be David Silk was, and uh, Jack O'Callaghan, the Eastern guys had their pranks, and Michael Rizzioni did too. And joined when the fact that we started a draft of the campers. I mean, it took a, a different uh, perspective for them to realize that this is truly, I'm being drafted. This is how it really is. And, and I don't think at first they understood what the draft meant or, or what it was implied for. However, when they started to be moved from one team to another, from the blue to the red or whatever, because of the draft, they realized something about what it's like to be traded from one team to another at the professional level.